Ultra, I'm doing another audio commentary here. I've decided to just move straight on to uh, game five of the skins match between Anytime, who we see here in front of us right now, uh, and Bisu, who I believe is going to be the purple player. Yeah, so Bisu's going to be purple, and he's at 12 o'clock-ish position, maybe 11, 30 or so. Anytime's going to be in red uh, at the left-hand position. Battle of the uh, Titanic Colors, for those of you that uh, believe in that sort of thing. Um, yeah, and it's showing there at the top, by the way, the, the, the money count so far. Bisu's accumulated 400,000 won, and uh, anytime he's accumulated 600,000 won throughout the game. It looks like every game is getting... Um, I thought they increased more less incrementally, but it looks like so far every game has increased by 100,000 won. So... Uh, this game is worth 500,000 won, which is about 500 bucks, uh, or, um, yeah. Anyway, anytime, we got, uh, BC putting down a pylon. Again, very, very risky maneuver here, putting down pylons, uh, and uh, anytime, I assume, is probably going to put down his pylon as well. Now, uh, <clears throat> this has been a pretty exciting match so far. Last game, we saw Bisu do yet another Templar rush, uh, um, be interested to see if he actually does that again because this is a map with a ramp and he seems to like to use that ramp uh, close off the ramp or actually last game he didn't even have to close it off but prepare to close it off with range goons and um, just go straight to some sort of tech and he's just gone DT rush almost every single time and any time has gone for observers every single time and it's been uh, the DT rush has not worked a single time so, I thought after the first couple of times, Bisu would have learned, but he had to do it a third time uh, as well. So, we'll see if he learned this time. Oh, anytime. I don't know if anytime saw that probe. If he did, he probably could have suspected that Bisu was at 12, and he might have redirected his probe. I don't think he saw it, though, because he's continuing to scout 6. Uh, maybe he'll change once he sees that probe enter his base there. Both players now, this time, going for uh, the Psychor. A couple of times before, we've seen Bisu go straight tech almost every time. Uh, but sometimes anytime has gone for uh, two gates, um, which hasn't done him a lot of good. Um, so now we just see her little harassment there. And yeah, anytime, it looks like anytime has decided to go straight for, well, well, we'll see where his probe goes. But it doesn't look like he fully scouted uh, six o'clock. It looks like he, he got into the natural there and just went up the ramp and didn't see anything. And, and could, no, he is going to go ahead and scout nine, I guess just for good measure. Um, although, t it's funny, it doesn't look like he's fully scouted uh, 6 o'clock spot. He has, he's now fully scouted 9. He's finally going to go uh, and uh, check uh, the 12 o'clock position. He's going to be able to see Bisu. It looks like Bisu getting up a second gateway now. Uh, I was looking at the mini-map, so I wasn't paying attention to the screen there for a minute, so I, I didn't actually see what that was. Um, <laughs> someone's got a probe over there behind their base. Wait, is that Bisu's own base? Never mind. Bisu's scout running away, being chased off by the Druid. He's not going to get any more intelligence there. And that's why it's also been curious to see Bisu go for um, go for the, the quick DTs. Usually he goes for the the quick uh, robotics facility so he can get observers and, and keep his, his intelligence count, uh, his intelligence high. Uh, usually he, okay, yeah. Now this time, finally, Bisu, Jesus Christ, finally getting the robotics facility instead um, <laughs> uh, instead of just going straight for DTs or whatever. So this is turning out to be a mirror game after all. Uh, oh, your probe got trapped in there. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, uh, yeah. Sorry, again, I'm just kind of off my game today. Maybe I'm rusty because I haven't been doing very many commentaries. Uh, it's hard to say. Anyway, uh, Bisu, it looks like he is going to kind of do the same thing. He's going to try and block off his ramp and then uh, tech up. Uh, behind that blockade there. He's cut probe production, it looks like, so uh, whereas Anytime has not. So we, we, we might be seeing Anytime expand here pretty soon. Uh, it looks like Beast is going to try and use that ramp, though. Uh, he may even get quick reavers out uh, to protect his ramp uh, and maybe expand with that, those reavers or something. I don't know, he's getting range upgrade. He, why isn't he putting down a, any more tech? He needs to be putting down... He's, he must be producing a shuttle. So that's probably what he's doing, he's getting the robotic support. No, he's getting the observatory, okay. Um, well, what we're probably going to see him uh, also get a robotics uh, support uh, pretty soon as well. 
and he'll probably get his shuttle out. Or no, well, I'm not sure actually. I, I would be expecting to produce the shuttle, otherwise he's not making use of that tech that he had. Uh, but he could have been just waiting for the observatory as well, which it looks like he has been doing. So now he's good. No, he did have that shuttle. I was right. Okay. Because um, otherwise there was no reason for him not to put down um, the tech uh, immediately after the uh, robotics uh, facility going up. So now, yeah, he did, he did produce the shuttle in the meantime. And he knew that there was going to be time spent making that shuttle anyway. So he didn't have to produce the tech very quickly. And he did time it perfectly such that the observatory came in right before... The shuttle was finished, so now they can produce the observer, and the robotic support bay probably finished right before the observer came out, and and indeed it did. So now he's producing that reaver pretty quick as well. So um, putting out that tech in very very quick order and in perfect sequence to get uh, the observer out first, uh, which you can see he's scouting with right now. He's got to make sure not to lose that though. Uh, obviously, well he's not going to know, but uh, anytime does have the observatory out as well. He's got observers. Uh, anytime doing exactly the same thing basically. Um, I don't recall if I saw a shuttle for any time or not, though. Yes, there's a shuttle. Okay. So he does have that shuttle, uh, and he's probably going to be producing a reaver here pretty soon as well. Uh, so pretty much mirror builds. I, I expected uh, any time to go for uh, observers earlier. I mean, sorry, for an expansion earlier, but he did not. Um, it looks like Bisu has that reaver out maybe a little bit beforehand, at the very least, He's got it in his shuttle beforehand. And now Bisu moving down here. He's just going to go for a frontal attack. He's not going to go for any um, kind of harassment here. So we're going to see some... This is going to come down to, to shuttle reaver micro versus shuttle reaver micro, basically. It looks like Bisu just have a few extra forces, though. Uh, so I'm gonna, Oh, no, he does go for some harassment while he's moving his forces in. It uh, looks like he's not able to accomplish a whole lot, but he is going to be able to send uh, Anytime's army back there. If he gets that... No, that shuttle's going to get away just barely. But uh, that was a close one there. Oh, 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 Bisu. If Bisu can move in, move in on Anytime's front door wall, Anytime's forces are back in his base protecting against that. Go in, Bisu. Go in now. Go in now. Go, 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 go. What are you doing? Ah. Uh. Okay, well, well no, he's going to... Nope, no, never mind. He's not. Look, his forces were shuffling about. And now Anytime has gotten his reaver back to his front door, and he's gotten his forces back to his front door, although not all of them. And here we go. That... Oh, Bisu's uh, shuttle getting picked off there. He is able to salvage that reaver though, and um, Anytime does have that shuttle, so I think Anytime is probably going to come out of this uh, a little bit better. Yeah, nice scarabs going off. He is short on forces, but with that that shuttle, he's going to be able to protect his reaver a lot easier. I'm surprised that that uh, uh, Anytime is not targeting that reaver. He could easily just go up and snipe that reaver, and he was not. And if he had done that earlier, if he'd sniped that reaver earlier, he would have taken that battle. But he did not snipe that reaver. And now, given it was uh, behind uh, Bisu's Dragoon, so it, it may have been uh, too difficult to get back there and, and actually pick off that reaver. But uh, I think he probably should have done something like that. And now, now Bisu has a little bit of a container. He's probably producing another shuttle right now. Uh, his next shuttle is going to be out to, to pick up that reaver very, very soon. But in the meantime, uh, Anytime does have two reavers, and so Bisu is not going to be able to break that ramp. Uh, at all. It, 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 we're probably going to expect any time to try and do some harassment here of his own. Uh, move that shuttle out, use that second reaver to protect his base while he's uh, moving out and uh, doing some harassment. We'll see if, if that's what he in fact does. He, yeah, his shuttle is moving that direction. Any, uh, Bisu's observer is right there and spots it. Um, so Bisu's going to know this is coming. Bisu has set up his expansion uh, and he's falling back for some reason from any, from any time's door. Um, I'm not sure exactly why. Maybe he wants to save that reaver. Uh, he, oh, he's produced a second reaver instead of a shuttle. So maybe he just wants to try and make this an economic advantage is what it looks like to me. He's uh, he's decided to to fall back his forces. Okay, never mind. Now he's gone back in again. So we'll see how this works. Oh, if you can pick off that shuttle. Pick off the shuttle. Pick off the shuttle. Oh, he tries to pick off the shuttle. Not quite able to. Uh, if he had picked off that shuttle, that would have been game. That would have been game right there. But he is not able to quite pick off the shuttle. Uh, be anytime able to hold that off. It looks like anytime building the expansion as well. But Bisu's expansion is going to be up uh, quite a bit earlier than uh, well. <laughs> Bisu's expansion is up, and anytime has not even started his yet. So uh, yeah, things looking very bad for anytime here. I think that uh, that Bisu is probably going to be able to take this game if things continue at this rate. Anytime has not done any harassment. He really needed to to, to do some harassment there, but he knew that he couldn't. Have, I guess he was thinking he couldn't afford to, to, um, to pull pull his reavers off of his front line to go and do harassment with them, uh, and I think that that was a mistake because 
I mean, Bisu obviously he knew that Bisu didn't have that shuttle anymore, and uh, so he would have been able to, to to deal with things a lot easier, especially holding that ramp. Um, so I, I I don't know. We'll see we'll see how this things turn out. But uh, now anytime going in with a little bit of an attack force here, a frontal attack force. Bisu picking off his observer there. I don't think that's going to do a whole lot of uh, make a whole lot of difference though. Bisu does not have the shuttle there, and anytime does have the shuttle. So he's they've both got two reavers right now. So the the shuttle micro may make the difference. We've seen uh, players like of this caliber completely eat other players, uh, just like run across the stage into the other battle cubicle and just eat their heart out uh, using shuttles. And uh, here we see. Oh, 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 I think he picked up that Reaver. Barely picked up. Yeah, he did get that Reaver there. And that is what the Shuttle Reaver Micro is all about. Picking them up just in time so they don't die. But it looks like Beastu just has way too many forces. This time the Shuttle gets picked off. And anytime GG's. I'm going to keep this under 11 minutes here. But thanks for watching.